from Kansas City, Missouri. Today we're in Arrowhead Stadium. For years, one of the great rivalries in the AFC, the Denver Broncos against the Kansas City Chiefs. You know, whenever you get two division rivals like these two, they're always playing for big stakes and a place in the standings. The Broncos and the Chiefs both have great winning tradition. Welcome to the game. EA is proud to bring you continuing coverage of the NFL. I'm Al Michaels with John Madden. Boy, the defense has shown in the past how dominant they can be. They're very aggressive, and it seems like all 11 guys are always around the ball. When you have guys flying around, making hits, causing turnovers, it creates a lot of problems for the offense. The Chiefs will need their running game to be at its best, otherwise they could be in for a long day. The best way to neutralize a good defense is by running right at them, so look for this back to get a lot of carries early on. They'll also use the run to set up a few long throws if they see that that safety is creeping up to the line of scrimmage. You can see these guys are fired up and ready to get this thing going. Let's go to midfield for the coin toss. Lined up for the kickoff, so let's get this game started. Elam is just about ready to kick this one away. Not a bad kick, they'll set up for the return. <laughs> the offense is heading out onto the field for their first drive of the game. Don't let those guys intimidate you. Get out there and run it down their throat. Dropping back with the throw on the run. Montana gunned the pass to his receiver. This is an example of the quarterback trusting his arm. He just made a decision, and the ball was there in a blink of an eye. Set. Come on, partner. Take him out. You got him. That's all you. Man in motion. Pass away here on first down. Under pressure. Oh, won't have to break stride. Took what he was given, completing the pass. Yeah, what you want to do as a receiver who's facing zone coverage is to break into the secondary, find a hole, settle down, and show the quarterback your number. That was a good job. Calling an audible now. Three, sixteen. They got nothing. That's all you got. Back off. Using team. motion. Gets the toss to the left. Allen couldn't get out of the backfield. That was just a defensive line getting lower than the offensive line. When your defensive guys up front can control the line of scrimmage, it makes it very difficult to move the ball on offense. Directing traffic. Yo, 25. Man in motion. Cross play to the left. Looks like he just made it past the mark. Good call that time, resulting in the first down. Move the chains with that completion. Yeah, and that was a great recognition by the quarterback. Knowing where to go with the football against the blitz and knowing how to get it there. And this is the seventh play of this drive. Calling an audible now. You got him. Get, get. Let's go. Come on. Give it to the halfback. Smith stops him for negative yardage. Couldn't get anything going through the middle. You know, it was because the defense filled all the gap. Back was looking for a place to run, but by bringing the run blitz, they took away all the gaps. 
Bringing him down for a loss. Montana sees something in the defense. Red, 25. Red, 25. Get all you got. Using motion. Huh. A five-yard pickup on that run by the tailback. This is a play that you need. Trust your quarterback to make a good throw here. This is the ninth play of this drive. Come on, see. Huh. Dropping back. Pressure. Gets the pass off. On the run. <laughs> he never hesitated on that pass. That was quite a throw. This guy's been blessed with a golden arm. It's first and ten. Ball on the 17-yard line. Man in motion. Huh? Pressure coming. Surveying the field. For the end zone. Touchdown, Kansas City. What a catch in the end zone. That's a guy you better keep an eye on down there in the red zone. He has a knack for finding ways to get open when there's a lot of traffic. So they're trying to tack on the extra point. The kick is up, and he tacks on the extra point. They made the defense look inept on that drive there. Chewing up more than half the field, taking more than four minutes, winding up with a touchdown. The defense was on the field for a long time, and they just couldn't stop him. Give credit to the offense for doing such a great job of executing. The offense heads out onto the field for the first time. Well, John, we've looked forward to this all week long. One of the top running backs in the league against one of the most dominant defensive units. Yeah, I've been looking forward to it. It's the old strength versus strength thing. This defense has a great front four and good team speed. This can be a heck of a game. One yard gain by the running back. Now, smart coach would call this defense. Second and nine. Ball on their own 20. Only one man in the backfield. Sure. The man in motion. Hand off to the tailback. Just about a three-yard gain there. Lose it, lose it. Third and seven. Ball on the 22 yard. This is a good special teams play. Unable to get anything going on that series, they'll have to punt it away here. Here's the kick. This one goes out of bounds. The key here is to step up into the pocket. Make sure you get those feet set before you throw it. Balling an audible now. Montana with a man in motion. Slings it to the outside. The receiver did a nice job creating some separation, enabling him to make the reception. The defense needs to keep track of that guy a little better. He can make that kind of grab anytime. Set. Yo, Calling an audible. Team. Using motion. Dropping back. Closing in. Gets the pass off. Incomplete pass. He just overthrew that one. And you want to lead the receiver so that he can catch and run. But you don't want to lead him that much. Under pressure, fires it out to the left. Watch it here. This is a great call on third down to keep this drive alive. They were in a tough spot here. But this is a heck of a throw and catch to pick up that first down. The backs are lined up in an eye. 
ball on the 36 yard line. Give it all you got, Pete. Come on. He sees something in the defense. Man in motion. Hand off to the tailback. A couple, maybe three yards on that run. Be aware of the defensive set. You've got to take what they're giving you. The Broncos come out in a nickel package. Using motion. Slings it out left side. Walker never took his eyes off the ball and made the catch. That receiver has it all. He can run and catch with the best of them. The defense better make sure that they have him covered. The Chiefs line up in the shotgun. All on the 40-yard line. Montana sends a man in motion. Pressure. This pass is incomplete. The incomplete pass brings up fourth down. Aguiar is back to punt. LaVille looks like he's ready for the return. Here's the punt. The officials are trying to determine where it went out of bounds. Give this one a try. They'll go from the I formation. Number seven gets set. It's the toss to the left. White makes the tackle at the 30-yard line. He got his hand on the face mask there, and it cost him. That defender almost pulled his helmet right off.49-yard line. Now, smart coach would call this defense. So they have first and ten here. At the end of one, these teams are separated by just a touchdown. With the score, Kansas City seven, Denver zero, and we're ready to start the second quarter. The backs are lined up in an eye. On the 49-yard line, get the ball. Here comes the heat. The Broncos using motion. Crosses it out to the right. Davis was stuffed on that play, John. They're just relentless when the offense decides to run the ball. They break down blocks very quickly. And they do a good job maintaining their gap assignments, limiting cutback opportunity. They line up in the I formation. Going to the left. Davis couldn't find an opening and was brought down very quickly. Yeah, he was. This line has to do a better job of holding up at the point of attack. He has a fast first step. He can explode through the hole, but he needs a line to create that little crease or cut back lane to break free. Pressure coming. Steps up. Gets the pass off, and it's intercepted. He loses the defender. The offensive line couldn't do the job, and the pressure forced him to make a bad throw into coverage. I'll tell you, it's very important to have pressure on the quarterback. What that does is make the secondary's job a heck of a lot easier. And on that play, it led to an interception. They'll go from the I formation. Man in motion. Hand it off. Just about a three-yard gain there. Scan the defense quickly here. If nothing's open downfield. Get rid of it by passing to one of your backs. Montana gets set. He sees something in the defense. Green, 74. Anders. About a three-yard gain for the fullback. Need to get some yards and keep this drive alive. It's third down and four to go. Ball on the 50. Get in there, Lon. right. They got nothing. They got nothing. Number 88 in motion. Dropping back with the throw. He's on the run. 
Now this is one heck of a play. Look at it. You're in a hole here on third down. They come through with this perfect play that gets him a first and keeps the drive going. They'll go from the I formation. Montana directing traffic. Sideline to sideline. Snake on. Kansas City Time will call out. a timeout call here. Offense. They have two left. So they have first and ten here. Ball on the 39 yard line. Closing in. Looking for a receiver. With the catch on the run. They convert for the first down on that throw. What a throw. He put everything he had into that one. The Chiefs using motion. Drops back. Under pressure. He's looking. Scrambling around. Gets the pin off. This offense having no trouble moving the ball on this drive. Yeah, and this defense is having a lot of trouble stopping. They can't seem to key on what they're doing and put an end to this drive. Walker comes in motion. Breaks free. Good blocking up front and a nice gain on the counter. Yeah, and that was a perfect call in that situation. He did a nice job avoiding the first wave of defenders, then converting for the first down. This is the seventh play of this drive. Green, Montana 16. directing traffic. Yellow, 16. Got the ball. Hut. Dropping back. Pressure. Slings it to the outside. And it's caught. Touchdown, Kansas City. He flips it in there for the touchdown. The receiver looked the ball into his hand. He knew right there he had six. And so once again, a touchdown pass. Elliott comes in for the extra point. And it's up. Point after attempt is no good. Here's the kickoff to him. And he got all of that one. A great kick. He downs it in the end zone. No return this time, and the offense heads out into the field, taking over at the 20. Number seven. With a man in motion. Hands it off to the back. The running back gets about three. They got nothing. The ball, the ball. Davis, the lone back. Pumps once. Pressure coming with the pass. The quarterback thought he had that one. You got to deliver the ball out there quickly, but it has to be catchable. You got to use some touch. Get in there. The out out. You got him. Call the special teams play. To line up for what will be his second punt of the game. Here's the kick. From the 36. He didn't have any room to run over there, John. And you don't want to delay too long when you're looking for that crease. You can find the crease once you start running. Montana sees something in the defense. Walker moves in motion. 
they'll mark it at the 41-yard line. Picks up maybe three on that carry. They'll go from the I formation. Calling an audible. Give it all you got, Pete. Come on. Three, seventy-four. Huh? Allen. Plows ahead. He has run. Allen did a nice job on that run. If the defense keeps giving up runs like that for first down, they'll have to make some adjustments to slow this guy down. Set. First and ten. Ball on the forty-five yard line. Montana sends a man in motion to the air on first down. He's looking, gives this one a ride to the left. Nearly intercepted. Close to a big play by the defense. And it probably should have been a big play. He had perfect position to get the interception. He just dropped it. Three, maybe four yards on the misdirection play. Need to get some yards and keep this drive alive. Here's a look at the third down success rate of each team. Third down conversions is a keeper stat. When you convert on third down, you keep three things. You keep your drive going, you keep their defense on the field, and you keep your defense resting on the sideline. Dropping back, closing in, closing downfield. He just kept dropping back and dropping back. I, yeah, I'm not sure what he was thinking on that one. He must have been waiting on the routes to develop. Before his receivers could get open, he got leveled for a big loss. This will be his second punt of the game. Here's the punt. And he waves for the fair catch. Here's a good defense for this situation. First and ten. Ball on their own 17. Davis. Kept it on the ground, picks up about seven. Two minutes left. A smart coach would call this play. Only one man in the backfield. Tightening up the coverage along the outside. Number seven. Get set. Drops back. Under pressure. It's first and ten. Sideline to sideline. He surveys the field. Penalty marks the down on the field. Gets the pass off. Almost got it. Offside. The defense was a bit too aggressive, and they're offside. That penalty was a costly one. It basically gives the offense a free play. Kansas City lines up with seven guys in the secondary. We got nothing. Set. Dropping back to pass on first down. He tried to pick up the yardage himself on that play. It looked like the defense was ready for that one. They were able to stop him for a minimal gain. Dropping back, Rowan grabs the off-target pass. Here's a no huddle. It's a good way to keep the defense off balance. The pass on first down. Throwing short to the right side. They went back to the screen. The screen pass requires that you have some quick linemen who can move wide and attack when set up blocks for the guy coming out of the backfield. Great play in the backfield by Smith. After the sack, they'll be looking at third and long here. Kansas City calls a timeout. They have none left. If they're going to get the first here, they'll need their offensive line to maintain their block and give the quarterback enough time to make a good throw. Man in motion. Get in there. They got nothing. Stay after him. Drops back. Pressure with the throw. 
incomplete pass. Not much touch on that pass. He may have tried to put a little too much oomph on that throw. Time for a punt here as it's now fourth down. Hughes is the deep return man. Here's the kick. Fair catch. He did the right thing. Concentrated and caught the ball. Get the pass and look to the sidelines. You can't let the clock run down here. It's first and ten. Ball on their own 25. Three, Calling an audible. Yeah. The quarterback gets set with only one back behind him. Using motion. Hands it off. Pick up of about six yards. What they're doing here is keeping the defense from huddling up. It keeps the same defense on the field. The rush is on. Gets the pass off. The 40. Puts it on the ground. The Broncos recover. Great play by the defense to recover the fumble. Yeah, they were right there to jump on the ball. Clearly a big momentum shift to begin making as we take a look at a possible fumble. And they really had no choice but to challenge it because of what it could mean for both teams. I don't know. It's a tough call from seeing that angle. After reviewing the play, the ruling on the field is overturned. The guys upstairs made the right call as the referee overturned the call and got it right. Yep, and it's important to get the calls right in these last two minutes. Montana back in the shotgun. Davis moves in motion. Dropping back to pass on first down. Throws it. Hits his receiver in stride. And he is bumped out of bounds at the 27. The defense has to come up big, or they'll find themselves in a big hole for the second half. They have to focus on not allowing a touchdown and forcing them to settle for a field goal. Set, Allen. Pressure coming. Scrambling. Tenacious pass rush on that play, John. Yeah, that's for sure. These guys can really get after the quarterback. They're going to keep it moving here. They're heading straight to the line. Set, Closing in. Looking for an option. Sends this pass out of play. So he didn't see anybody open. And just threw it out of bounds. You better kick it here. It's third down, and they have a long way to go. Ball on the 37-yard line. A lot of speed on the field for the defense as they line up in the quarter. Under pressure. Great play in the backfield. Couldn't find a way to keep the defense open. Once you start taking hits like that, you start to think about those hits, and that takes your mind off the passing game. It's the end of the second quarter with the score. Kansas City, 13. Denver, 0. Denver, nothing. Let's get back to the action on the field. Welcome back as we get the second half underway. He got all of that one. He decides not to return this one. No return on that kickoff, and they'll get ready to start the drive at the 20. Number seven. Sets up. Lose it. Lose it. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Crosses it out to the right. Davis didn't get any help from his offensive line. It was just about impossible to run when you have guys in the backfield just as soon as you snap the ball. Bust his grill, deep. Only one man back. Going to the left. Keeping him at this. Davis couldn't escape the pursuit and was cut down quickly. These guys up front are very tough to block because they can use their size and strength to get excellent leverage on running play. Sometimes they struggle a little with their consistency, but they always seem to be a big factor when the game's on the line. Pressure with the pass. The defense reaches him. So he's unable to get the first after making the catch. That play won't help their third down conversion percentage today. I wonder what the receiver was thinking. Running a route that wasn't going to put him past the first down marker anyway. So they'll line up the punt after going three and out. 
Here's the punt. And he signals for the fair catch. That's a good job of getting downfield by the cover team to force the fair catch. So they have first and ten here. Ball on their own 37. Allen lines up behind his fullback in the eye. Pressure coming. Throws it. It's his receiver in stride. The 40. Nice execution on that play court. That pass play was almost perfect. The only thing they didn't do was score. Montana directing traffic. The Chiefs using motion. Looking upfield. Can't bring him down. Not much there. Maybe a yard. Get some time in the pocket and be patient with it. Don't force it into cover. And they need about nine. Ball on the 34-yard line. Looking for a receiver. Hits him on the run. Good connection there. This guy has great confidence in his arm. He knows that he can make the completion regardless of the coverage. The backs are lined up in an eye. Well, here's a look at his numbers after a nice run, and you can see he's been able to break some tackles. Catch the ball, man. Deal. Cowboy. They got nothing. Red. Changing the play now. Give it to the halfback. Just about a three-yard gain there. Your guys can smell the end zone. Give it to your back and let them finish this drive off. Second and seven. Ball on the 14-yard line. of a couple on that carry. On the run. You need a nice pickup here. Make sure he's deep enough before you throw it. As they get ready for this third down play, we'll take a look at how they've done today. Third down is when you want your players to dig deep and make a clutch play. When you convert, it gives your defense a little extra rest, and it gives your offense a fresh set of downs to work with. Drops back. Closing in with the throw. A little behind, but he has it. They've got something going here. Yeah, it's been one first down after another. They're putting together a nice-looking drive here. Davis comes in motion. Under pressure with the pass. Touchdown, Kansas City. And so just like that, pass, catch, touchdown. That's just a quick move by the receiver, and a pass that was right on target from the quarterback. So he found his target, and for the third time, it goes for a touchdown. The lineup for the extra point. And it's on its way, and the extra point is good. The last drive, John, went for a touchdown with some excellent play call. I think the whole team's happy after that one. They're probably telling their defense to give them the ball back so they can go score again. Booming kick downfield. He takes a knee. No return on that kickoff, and they'll get ready to start the drive at the 20. It's first and 10. Ball on their own 20. Only one man back. Hand it off. It's the core picks up four, maybe five there. Kansas City lines up with seven guys in the secondary. Get at him, Keith. Number seven. Sets up. That good penetration, and that led to the sack. Great intensity and relentless pursuit got him that sack. 
Seven yards to go. Third and seven. Pressure. Rowan. He finds his man. White stops him at the 43-yard line. Give this one a try. So they have first and ten here. It's the toss to the right. And he's brought down in the backfield by Jameson. They were waiting for him as he tried to take it to the outside. And that run started off going east and west, which isn't bad. But then it got worse, and it went south. Second and long. With the throw, and it's caught. Number seven delivered that one with just the right amount of touch. He's one of those guys who's extremely accurate with his passes. His receivers rarely have to make any adjustments in their routes to come up with a ball. Three minutes remaining in the quarter. Pump faking. Rosen. He's on the run. The 30. The quarterback lets it go and it found its warrant. This is one of those guys who's always had a pretty good arm. He always seems to do a good job of reading the defense. On the call. Picked up nine on the play. A smart coach has called this play. Within scoring distance. Smith, the motion man. He'll get it again. Davis wasn't able to get anything going on that play. They got there and shut that play down very quickly. That's just a case of studying game film this week paying off. When you know what they like to run in certain situations, you can anticipate the play call and stop the play before it even gets started. With the carry, Davis couldn't even get out of the backfield. This defense is extremely active and effective up front. They do a good job of getting upfield quickly. Creating havoc in the backfield. Misdirection plays and draws could be a good way to use their speed and aggressiveness against them. The Chiefs call a timeout. They have two timeouts remaining. Number one into attempt for field goal. The kick is up. A nice kick, and it's good. The Broncos chip away at the lead, but still need some breaks to get back in this one. Hila comes in to kick off. And he got all of that one. A great kick. From the three-yard line. Now here it is. He shows a lot of determination in getting to the ball carry on this one. Look at how he fights off the blocker, and he makes a heck of a play to bring him down. Set. Breaks free. The 40. At the 40. The 30. And he's pushed out of bounds at the 20-yard line. Okay, now you're close. Get even closer with this pass. First and 10. So we've reached the end of the third quarter with the Chiefs ahead of the Broncos 23. And we'll start the fourth quarter. The quarterback gets set with only one back behind him. Just about two yards on the run by the halfback. You're in a good position here. Get the snap, drop back, and let your guys get open. Don't force anything. Second and seven coming up here. Set. Calling an audible. Yeah, Dropping back. Pressure coming. Surveying the field. Gets the pass off. After hauling in that pass, he now has three in the game. You need to keep the ball moving. Just do whatever you have to to pick up the yardage you need. Set. 
Closing in. Gets rid of it. And the catch is made. They complete the pass for the first down. That showed awareness by the receiver. He knew just where he had to go to get the first down, crossed the marker, and then looked for more. So they've had a lot of success so far in the red zone, and they'll try, obviously, to continue that here. Changing the play now. Crosses it right. Touchdown, Kansas City. So they get in on the ground. Yeah, he knew where he wanted to go, and he got there. They'll line up for the extra point. And here's the kick. No, it's a fake. He's looking. And the kickoff team comes out onto the field. It's on its way. From the eight-yard line. The Broncos will start this drive from the 21-yard line. Here's a good defense for this situation. The backs are lined up in an eye. First and ten. 94. We got nothing. Man in motion. Davis. Picks up five. On the run. Five-yard gain on the play. Stepping up, under pressure, gets rid of it. The 50 will bring him down at the 44 yard line. Amazing play by Green. The thing is, he got some separation there, and he was able to get him a big chunk of yard. Davis lines up behind his fullback in the eye. Gets the pass off. Watch this one again. He's trying to make the catch, and the defender comes in there and just unloads on him. But he's still able to hold on to it for a heck of a play. Dropping back, throws it, drops the interception. John, I don't know how they didn't pick that one off. Yeah, he had an excellent opportunity to end the drive right there. He just couldn't bring it in. with the throw and this pass is completed can't pull him down that'll move the chains John yeah when you put together a great pass with a heck of a catch that's exactly what you're gonna get dropping back throws it great throw second and short of coming after a good pickup through the air right here is one of those situations where you can pretty much open up the whole playbook you can go with a play fake and look for something deep, or you can just run the ball. Just about anything is an option. With the throw, the pass falls incomplete. That incomplete pass will bring up third down. Heck, this is a good one to call. One yard to go. Ball on the 15-yard line. Back off, DB! Number seven. Sets up. Let's go, ball! With the pass, this pass is incomplete. Fourth down, but coming after that incomplete pass. Kansas City will call a timeout here. They have one timeout left. Fourth and one. Ball on the 15-yard. Davis, setting up play action, still running. The defender goes down. Touchdown, Denver. Okay, here it is. They get a clear shot. He keeps his legs moving. He keeps his balance, and he doesn't go down. This is exactly how to get the ball into the end zone. So they'll try to get the two here. Drops back. 
pressure coming. Lobs one into the end zone. So they get the touchdown and now the two. And so the offense is able to drive the majority of the field and finish with a touchdown. And give some credit to that big offensive line. Those guys are working hard out there and it's showing on drives like that. They get the ball back after a touchdown in the last possession. And let's see about a repeat performance on this drive. Montana sets up. Look at that power. Stiff arms the defender to the ground. Three, maybe four yards on the misdirection play. You got to be aware of everything going on out there. If you see a weakness, you got to attack it. Allen is the deep back. Second and six. All on the 25-yard line. Stick up! Using motion. Bring the Closing in. Surveying the field. Right on time. He makes a terrific catch for the first down. Even the receiver was surprised how quickly that one got to him. That's the kind of thing you just hope you can hang on to as it goes by. Montana sets up, calling an audible now. Buster Squirrel, Deep, 94. The Chiefs the call a timeout. timeout. They have no timeouts left. The quarterback gets set with only one back behind him. Looks like he's changing the play. Allen. And he's brought down at the 32. Allen was dragged down before he could get to the line of scrimmage. They have great size and quickness up front. That allows him to hold up against the run while also giving him the speed to rush the passer when they drop back the pass. 3, 16. Dawson in motion. Aldridge stops him for negative yardage. All you need to do here is run some clock. Run the football up the middle. Directing traffic. Montana sends a man in motion. Under pressure, fires it out to the right. On the money, the 40. He continues to pile up the passing yards. He's now over 250 through the air. First and 10. Ball on their own 46. Well, here's a look at his numbers after a nice run, and you can see he's been able to break some tackles. They line up in the I formation. Ball on the 46-yard line. Penalty marker down on the field. He has room. Left sides. On the defense. The penalty is declined. First down. Run the ball. Get up slow. And keep the clock moving. He sees something in the defense. Walker goes in motion. Pickup of six on the counter. Keep this to the inside. You just need to run that clock down. Set, yellow. Changing the play now. Three, sixteen. Maybe a yard on that counterplay, no more. All you need to do here is run some clock. Run the football up the middle. A little over four to go. Montana sets up. Two minutes to go. Time to give it to your halfback. Tell him to look for a hole to open up inside. Set, 
Calling an audible now. The Chiefs using motion. They get it again on third down. That's the kind of thing that deflates a defense. They keep getting them in these third down situations. They can't seem to get the offense off the field. This one is just about in the books. Using motion. Hand it off. The Broncos call a timeout. They have one timeout remaining. Second and five. Man in motion. Good play in the backfield by Taylor. What a play here. When you anticipate the snap count perfectly, this is what will happen. I mean, he was into the backfield on top of the quarterback before he could even get the handoff. So as they get set to try to convert, here's what both teams have done on third down. Third down conversions are usually a good barometer of how well your offense is playing. It means that your offense is making big Yellow, plays 16. when they need them. Looks like he's changing the play. Blue, 16. Blue, 74. Right. Got the ball. Using Stop. motion. Huh. Denver will call a timeout here. That's their final timeout. You better kick it here. comes into the game to try the field goal. The kick is up. And it's good. He's one of those guys who really works hard at what he does. And you can see that hard work paying off when you make a kick like this one. From the four. The offense with a lot of success through the air on the last drive as they move downfield for the touchdown. The defense is trying to force a turnover, which would put an end to this game right now. We're just about down to one minute. 94. He'll pass on first down. With the throw, the incomplete pass bringing up second down. They're going to make the quarterback keep throwing because it's the only way that they have a shot at coming back. Runsable. Didn't get very far. This is a guy who's willing to run with it any time on any down in any situation. This time the defense was ready, and they got him before he could get very far. And the catch is made. Good looking play there as they pick up the first down and keep the drive alive. And they're going without a huddle. And what they'll look at here is exactly where the ball was when he went down. Yeah, they're thinking the ref is going to give him that left foot spot when they were thinking it should have been a right foot spot. The call on the field is overturned. It was unclear initially why they called for a review, but now we understand the reason. Yeah, it's important to get the calls right at this point of the game. Kansas City stays in its base defense, even though the offense comes out with five receivers. You should probably play it safe, just down the ball.
This game reaches its conclusion with the final score, Kansas City 29, Denver 11. For EA Sports, this is Al Michaels and John Madden wishing you a very pleasant good evening.